What's up guys, this is Pro Warriors. Today when I try to open the Bluestacks emulator, I encountered this error. The application was unable to start correctly. This is a common error that can be found for any other software or games like GTA 5, Fortnite, Premiere Pro, etc. In this video, we are going to show you how to fix the application was unable to start correctly for Windows 10 and 11. Please like and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to smash the bell button. Please open the start menu and then type on the search bar virus and threat protection and open it from the best results. Find manage settings under the section of virus and threat protection settings. At the next page scroll down and find out exclusion. Then click on add or remove exclusions. Again click on add and exclusion then right click on files. And now we need to find out and select that software exe file of your desired software software or games such as Bluestacks, generally it will be located inside the local drive C then program files. As I said before just to select the exe file of that software was having this arrow then click on ok. This way you can add multiple exe files from now what will happen the windows defender will no longer disturb that specific apps. Our second step is to delete the temporary files on windows using the the run command. Open search option and type RUN or press Windows plus R key at the same time to open run dialog box. Type TEMP into the open field and then press enter. This will open the temporary files folder. Press Ctrl plus A keys or select all the files in the folder and press the delete key to delete the selected files. Again open run command and this time you have type percentage TEMP percentage this will open the temp file folders select all the temp file and delete and make sure you have deleted these files from recycle bin after that click on the windows icon and type cmd in the search bar and right click on the command prompt and open it run as administration now we have to type in the run command chk DSK. Then simply press enter. The process of examination will start which will end in a few seconds. You need to wait for some minutes so that stages of examining get completed. As you get the total duration in the end, it means that this process of examination has ended. After that close the current CMD file. Again click on the windows icon and open command promo by running as administration. This time you need to type a new command SFC slash scan now and then press enter. This process of scanning will get started. You need to wait for a few minutes as this process of scanning will get completed. If your system has any corrupted files, this process will automatically repair them. So you need to wait to make this process to be completed now. There you can see the scanning process has ended. My Windows resource protection didn't find any issue in my windows after all this process you need to restart your pc to save all the changes if you think this video is useful please like and subscribe to our channel no more today see you in the next video take care